Hi guys, I'm sorry for the delay. This laptop is busy twigging here. I was trying to close my mic so it won't crash 1000 because I see that it's not willing to spike. But otherwise, guys, um, your boy, the big fish, I'm here. I'm not going to waste time. Um, I'm going to talk about both topics, right? Uh, most of you want me to talk about both topics. And before we... <laughs> Um, before I'm sorry to waste your time to your your data guys before we, we 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 go any further just tell me where are you watching from yeah tell me where are you watching from you know how we do it so today I'm here to talk about forex today I'm not here to talk about the emotions now I'm talking about the real thing forex let's discuss the real thing otherwise guys share where you're watching from 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 like I said um I asked on my Telegram channel, I asked, should I talk about uh, um, fundamentals or technical? They are saying both. They voted both. They voted for both. So, yeah, I don't know choice. Let's just, let's just do, do both and see how we, 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 we can, we, how far we can push. So, fundamentals. Fundamentals. Let's see how many fundamentals we have in the house. Northgate, Cape Town, Degasport, Tembisa, Newcastle, uh, KZN. Guys, great. Namibia, Limpopo, Chefluop, uh, North, Northwest, Poch, uh, Mankwing, uh, so Swaziland. okay guys now i appreciate that i appreciate that oh i i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry i blocked uh, the mic i hope now I'm, um you can you guys can hear me guys i was saying remember i said we're going to talk about uh, uh, uh i'm going to talk about both fundamentals and technicals yeah i've noticed i'm sorry I'm, i noticed that I, I i was actually blocking the mic can you confirm if you are, are you able to hear me now? Oh, okay. Are you able to hear me now? Confirm so that I can continue. Can you hear me now? Can you hear me now? It's proper now. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Um, let's not waste time, guys. Fundamentals. Let's see. Let's see how many fundamentals traders do we have in the in in, in the house. Let's see. Um, as you guys are busy commenting, I just want to see those who are uh, doing fundamentals. I'll be honest with you. On my Instagram, the response that I got, majority were saying fundamentals, fundamentals, fundamentals. There was no both. Okay, there was both, but they were not a lot compared to the ones who are saying fundamentals, 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 fundamentals. On my Telegram channel, they voted for both. They voted for both. Majority uh, 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 vote, uh, voted for both. Now, let's discuss fundamentals first, and then we'll move to 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 um, to. We'll then move to uh, uh, technical. And then we'll try to see how can we mix the two. You know, how can we mix the two? So now, fundamental, guys. What is fundamentals? Fundamentals is well known to be your, your news releases. Okay, obviously it's your news releases. But when we talk about uh, fundamentals, obviously once we mention fundamentals, in your mind you think about interest rate, you think about uh, GDP, you think about retail sales, you think about... Uh, uh, unemployment, unemployment uh, 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 change. You think about uh, NFP, right? Not an unemployment, employment change. You, you think about NFP now, guys. NFP fundamentals, fundamentals. Ever since the start of lockdown, it was doing bad. In fact, the first 20, 21 days, it was extremely bad. It was extremely bad. Fortunately, some of us have. Uh, we are best of both. I had to full, uh, shift my focus to uh, te technical. Try technical. Try technical. Everything was fine. Um, at that moment, I was busy on on 
uh, I was focused on price, price action. Everything was fine. We are profitable here and there. Try to push consistency because that's what I always push. Me, I, I prefer consistency. I always think, push for consistency. I want to be consistent. I trade to win trades. I don't trade to make money. I trade to win trades. So whatever analysis that I make, I want to win that particular analysis. So now, so fundamentals are doing extremely bad. But what do we do about that? What do we do about that? You need to focus on other things. If I'll, I'll give you an advice. If you are comfortable with, uh, with fundamentals, then you need to find out what kind of fundamentals um, are, 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 can actually be profitable during COVID-19 or during lockdown. Because there's nothing much. Oh, NFP, nothing much is happening in there. The NFP that were profitable that I traded was the one for, 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 for April, May, what well, was profitable, and June. It was profitable as well. As for July, mm -hmm, it was disaster. And to be honest with you, I'm predicting the same performance on the, the this upcoming uh, this coming one. When when is it? On the seventh of of August, I think. Uh, I'm anticipating that we won't have we won't have that great movement. You know. So, if you are a fundamental trader, what is it that you can trade that can actually assist you? Um, to keep going because I mean some of us we live on the market we make money on the market if I'm not making anything on the market it means I don't have any money so I have to always find ways you know unlike someone who's working they have a salary now nah, when fundamentals are not doing well they just take break from trading if I take break from trading it means I don't have any money that's the thing so I always have to find things that are working for me you know so now those who are in fundamental, the only fundamental thing that has been performing and doing well, the only thing that has been doing well, like I told you, don't be sold a strategy. They say uh, 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 there's a strategy, uh, half past three, this and this and this. No, 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 guys. Half past three, Nasdaq, it's volatile. It's a given, that one. It's a given fact. It's half past three every day. It doesn't matter which day is it. It's not, it, do, it doesn't matter. Every Every, every, uh, uh, during weekdays, half past three, NAS 100 is very volatile. That's the, it's not the only one. I'll give you that, that only. I'll talk about that only. Uh, there's, there's, uh, other, there's still, I think there are three. I know three pairs that are volatile that, uh, react to, uh, fundamentals like crazy, crazy. You just need to, to find a way. How do you make money with that kind of volatility? And at the same time, remember, it's extremely dangerous. So half past three, NAS 100, it's very volatile. You hear that. Someone is saying, I mostly focus on NAS 100 and gold. Those who are in fundamentals, that, uh, fundamentals, uh, 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 when they talk about fundamentals, they're referring to your interest rate, NFP. You hear other people are trading gold. They know that uh, from half past three, half past three to, to 5 p.m., Gold and NAS 100, very volatile. Those are the fundamentals you need to focus on. Because that other one that we are used to, nothing is happening there. So how do I know these things? I always say I forever have a learning attitude. When things are not going my way, I always go back to the drawing board. I want to know why. Why is this things happening? That's where I, I used to, I, I found out that uh, this and this and this is very volatile. You see people are, guys, Guys, wake up. People are telling you there. Those are some of the things I didn't want to mention. German 30, US 30, very volatile. Those are the kind of fundamentals you need to learn about. You know, they can actually, they are actually profitable. You just need to be consistent and you need to know how to attack those. Because otherwise, you hmm? Don't be overexcited. NAS 100 is very difficult, very tough, very tough. So you can actually lose a lot of money trying to, 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 to make money. Otherwise, guys, the other thing, the other thing, I think with fundamentals, we are done. We are done. Otherwise, your normal events of fundamentals, interest rate, those things, they are not performing well. It's disaster. It's disaster. I keep, uh, give, uh, keep uh, uh, checking on them. Ah, shame, get my tired. 
Kematata. So let's rather focus on on other things. Uh, US 30 pays more than us 100. I know my guy. I know my guy. It's just that you know how uh, uh, as people how we are. Uh, as soon as we hear about NAS 100, everyone else, their focus shift to the other side, you know. So some of us, some things we know is just that we don't want to share. I mean, sometimes it's best you, you make money uh, uh, when everyone, some, everyone know about those particular things. You know that once they move to the other side or they, ca they come join us, we are sorted. We have made enough and enough money from uh, 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 that particular in 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 this as if it's an in this or but that particular pair the other thing again guys um ish, i forgot i wanted to say this yeah definitely definitely half past three you must know what you are doing otherwise hey i but otherwise guys uh uh now let's talk about technical Technical can be profitable. It is profitable. And and um during my my in the past in the past 18 months when, when I was busy learning technical and all that, I realized that at some point I realized that it's actually more reliable than um than fundamentals. Don't get me wrong technical i realized that it's more reliable than fundamental technical you deal with setups if it's price action setups you deal with price price action setups the market in most cases when it moves it keeps uh, repeating the same setups same setups but in different ways i'll talk about things like your Let's say bearish engulfing. Once you see a bearish engulfing pattern, you know it's that it, now it's, it's time for the market to to fall. You know. So yeah, I keep emphasizing one thing in my videos: more knowledge, invest in knowledge, invest in knowledge, invest in knowledge. You will know all these things. It's not that difficult for 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 for, for people to actually know all these things. So if you invest most of your time in this thing, guys, me, I live a very simple life. I sleep, I wake up, take a bath in the morning, I'm on the market. If I'm going somewhere for a meeting, I'm forever on the market. If I'm not driving, I'm on the market. I spend most of my time on the market. The demo accounts, I always have a demo account on my on my, 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 my MT4, my MT5 for practicing purposes. I always learn new things on the market. Those that I hear from you guys, those that I, 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 I read myself i keep learning new things so that's what i'm actually advising you guys to do um when i said i'm taking 50 people under my my wing for mentorship that thing is not really mentorship and i said i want people who are serious i want people who are in forex but they are not profitable that's i'm looking for those i don't want newbies i don't want people where i'm gonna start from scratch and explain this is a candlestick you buy you do this set take profit you do this i don't want that I don't want that. I just want the, the information that I have, the, the, the strategies that I have to catch spikes, the strategy I, I use to uh, trade against spikes, the strategies I use for fundamentals. I'm able to, I know the, the, the direction of NFP, uh, 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 interest rate, the one under USD, USD interest rate, I know the direction. GBP uh, interest rate, it's always manipulative. That one, I, I, I would say I'm 50 it's actually 50 50 I, I make money on it i lose them sometimes i get it right sometimes i get it wrong so all those things the people who will be under my wing those are the people that will be uh getting this information you know but otherwise guys uh knowledge is power let's go for knowledge and and as i was saying technical what i like about technical is that if you you if you take your time when you analyze if you analyze from higher time frames go into lower time frames and from lower time frames to higher time frames the chances are you will be a profitable trader because you take well informed decisions even when you, you let's say you analyze nas 100 you see on a uh, based on h4 you see that it's on an uh, uh, an uptrend however 
on M30 or M15, you see a sell opportunity. You know very well that you need to apply time management. You need to apply time management because as much as you see a sell opportunity, this thing it's on on a higher uh, 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 time frame. It's on a uh, uh, an uptrend. So if you hold for too long, the chances are when you come back, it will be in a loss. So. I'm comfortable with taking well-informed decisions when I'm trading. Well, I, I, I'm comfortable with that. In most cases, I'll, I'll, I'll have my setups. Uh, this setup, they tell me that I'm, I have to buy NAS 100. I'll still go back to my indicators if I, I want to go to my indicators, check my indicators and various indicators for that matter. Check. In most cases, particularly the signals that I send to my, my people, that is why most of them, they only, they, most of the signals... We always get them right. It's because I take informed decisions. I don't just take a decision based on what this, I mean, these fake breakouts, there's all those things, sort of things. So you need at least three factors to influence your decision. You know that I'm buying because there's a, 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 there's a, what? The, on my trend line, there's actually, it's actually on a, on a, on a downtrend. And it's actually on the third touch. Now it's going, it's, it's, it's going up. And also, you have this. You have engulfing where it's actually turning. It's turning. You, you also have an engulfing bearish. I mean, I mean, bullish engulfing. You also have bullish engulfing. You know that for a fact that that thing has to go up. It has to go up. So, guys, when we trade, let's try by all means to take well-informed decisions. Let's take trading as business. That thing is business. And now I remember what I wanted to tell you guys about fundamentals. Uh, we have companies in the country, companies that are, that are uh, let's say, for example, your Bitvest. We know what Bitvest does. Okay, they do a lot of things, but we know that they are into... They are some. Uh, they are into cars. They, they are into uh, these things of security. They are into a lot of things. Now there was COVID nineteen. They shifted to supply of of um, COVID nineteen uh, products like your sanitizer, whatever, whatever. That you need to have that kind of attitude, guys. If fundamentals are not doing well, shift the focus. Trade trading as a business. If business is bad for that particular month, if business is bad for uh, two months in a row, guys, you need to change how you do things, you know? Try other things. Try other options. I know you you, 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 you might hate, uh, you are a technical trader, you hate fundamentals, but if technical is really teaching you bad, why don't you move to, to fundamentals? You know, at the moment, some of us are experiencing a high level of manipulation by dairy it's it's out of order guys it's out of order but let me tell you one thing i spent the past five days working on how do i make money with this manipulation of theirs i always work with what i have if the if i have my systems if i have my indicators if my analysis are always uh, uh, manipulated how do I make money out of that because I can't just sit down and say but they are manipulating yes they are manipulating but I also have to pay my bills I need to trade I need to find ways how do I make money out of the same manipulation so I had to go back to the drawing board read study things how can I catch this uh, 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 spikes during the, the manipulation and guys guess what within three days time I got it I got what I was looking for. So let's treat business. Let's treat trading as business. This thing is business. You know? This thing is business. It's not gambling. It's business. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, that is that man. <sighs> that is that guys. So sometimes you know, let me just go back to fundamentals again. 
fundamentals how you how most of you trade fundamentals it's more like a gambling to you guys a gambling it's when you go to a machine or go to meropa casino you go there you put a you buy a voucher for for a thousand rent you put that voucher in the machine you keep gambling 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 hoping that you will make man and you don't make man the 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 the, the man uh, uh, that voucher expires you need to buy another one you buy another one you don't make money most of you are trading fundamentals just like that guys let me tell you something if you were to when you trade nas 100 ne? let me just tell you a secret when you trade nas 100 particularly the one at half past three you put ten thousand rents in your account your target is two thousand rents which is something very doable doable you can sell or buy just guess just take a guess you buy you sell or buy with 0 0.01 it can reject go to a loss of 4000 you keep holding guess what you will close with profit so now that's not gambling because the account is big you know that the market guys the market moves like this it moves like this. It might you can see an opportunity for a sell. You you sell, but before it sells, it actually rejects. Go up. It goes up before it sells, then comes back to a sell. Hence, we always say every trade start with a red screen that to, for it to turn into a blue screen. So let's let's be let's be smart, guys. Let's let's there's some things are just out there you know and you guys will go for uh, uh, mentors looking for 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 strategies looking for whatever whatever mentors in most cases we have our own times we have our own lives i mean i can't always babysit you but you need to go to mentors knowing what you want you must go to mentors because you you have tried everything you are just not profitable most of you i i once had a a student whereby they had a lot of information they didn't know how to use it when they came to me i just mentored them in a direction whereby i told them to say this is how you need to use this information it will work best for you if you use it this way and this way and they did exactly that and guess what they are doing well they are doing extremely well you know so um otherwise guys I'm, I'm asking you for a favor. Take screenshot of this life. Uh, uh, post it on your, on your, on your, share it on your stories, Insta stories, and tag me. And tag me. And tag the big fish. And tag the big fish. And tag the big fish. Guys, I'm here for you. I'm here to empower you guys. I'm here to boost your, your guys' confidence. I'm here to boost your guys' morals. I want you to make it out of the market. I want you to make it out of the market guys if 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 that microsoft company of bill gates it took them uh 30, 30 years to be what it, what they are today i mean you don't even three, have three years in uh, uh, in in forex and you, you want to give up don't give up let's keep pushing let's keep pushing good people let's keep pushing that pdf that you 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 passed in telegram uh that technical pdf you passed in telegram group powerful yeah it's very powerful i like it i like it um um let's let's just and the other thing i i the link there i pinned a link for for my 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 telegram channel those who are not following me please follow me please um subscribe because i'm, I'm i was actually thinking of uh dropping if we take the channel to to 4k before month end i might drop another pdf i might drop another pdf you know so yeah i think i've discussed both uh, fundamentals and technicals and yeah uh, people are asking me about brokers guys i asked you a favor take a screenshot of this like of, of this um live video share it on your stories and mention me mention the big fish please guys just 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 as a token of appreciation please please pretty please pretty please pretty please it's not too much to ask i know so otherwise guys 
uh, as I'm busy, what's the best time on Saturday to trade boom and crash? Uh, oh yeah, maybe I must also share that. The best time to trade boom and crash, particularly if you are trading spikes, the best time is um, from half past 3 a.m. until 11 a.m. They hardly manipulate there, but from there, yo, uh, the manipulation is out of this world. If those who were uh, trading boom yesterday, the boom was doing extremely well in the morning, but from 12, it kept going down. It broke about seven, if not eight, resistance. I mean, uh, supports, support lines. I'm talking about strong, strong, strong support lines. You can imagine. So, the best time is between 3 a.m. And 11 a.m. Guys, I'm here, guys. I'm here for you guys. If you, 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 I think this week, this upcoming week, I'll give you guys a platform to uh, decide on a topic. You will just tell me whatever that you want me to, 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 to discuss. Guys, I, I hate, I hate repeating myself. I had a special video explaining why I left. So just go there, watch that video. It's on my, my Instagram. Stop asking me those things. We are very cool. I said we are cool. You guys are always looking for gossip. Um, guys, I, I asked you for a favor. I said, take screenshot of this live. Mention me on your, on your, on your stories. I mean, share on your stories and mention me there. Guys, please, pretty please. I don't have anything to post today. I don't want to post trades. Yeah. Hey, man, I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. Hi. Me, I don't do those things. I'll go to the house. I don't do those things. But otherwise, guys, uh, let's, let's have a short Q&A. Ask questions, I will answer. Ask questions, I will answer. Let's do that for the next three minutes. Ask questions, I will answer. So that because at me, I don't like these long videos, you know. So I want to save the video and focus on my on my my trading. You gave us powerful knowledge, my brother. God bless you. I always do, my guy. I always do. I, I will ignore them, but I will address them before I ignore them. You must know that if you pay until the mama high level 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 to one, now Saturday I pull up to a high more in. Some of us man, we 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 don't talk about other people. We don't even ask a lot about other people. Your 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 things are your things. Armata walu ena. Armu. My focus is on one thing. This is where my focus is, and my fo my my focus will forever. Be here. This is where my focus is. Nothing will change. This is where my focus is. So, va le na va orata deta. Na ko focus jamu marketing. So lo ena uza mo focus on other things because if you want to know much about LATP, you will know much about LATP. But it's not like you're gonna get paid for knowing much about LATP. So your questions are here, ne? Kevan na basari ya, vele kevan na basari. What time do you trade VIX? It depends. I have to do my weekly analysis for VIX today. Uh, yeah, yeah, today. Uh, in fact, it's monthly analysis, not really a weekly. Mm. Best broker to use. I brokers, guys, these days, me, I no longer believe in the best brokers, but there's nothing like that. Brokers are manipulative, all of them. Others, they are not manipulative. You trade, you make money, they don't want to pay you. So brokers have their own problems. The most important thing, let's just make sure that we trade with regulated brokers. I'm having more than seven PDFs. I don't know how to use them. Share with me, my guy. I will, I will, I will, I will just see, I'll just go, uh, go through them when I have time this week. And I'll get back to you as to which one I think it's 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 more uh, uh, powerful and it can be profitable. Just share with me. Hit me up on my DM. I'll share my number. Done with the post. Uh, can you? Yeah, you can make it on derive with a, 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 a ten dollars account. It's possible. Best time to trade VIX according to you. Do you think? Boom. Respect. Boom 500. Ah, that thing. Boom 500. 
Ah, that thing can be out of order. That one, Joe. How much should I put for Nasan Andred? Whatever that you are willing to, to, to lose. On the market, we put money that we are willing to lose. How much money did you have when you started? I get the answer. Jerry Mochi, give us your broker. I use. I use Dubix 360 for NAS 100. I use a uh, uh, Veracity for NAS 100. I use just just Forex Pro account for NAS 100. For Forex Pairs, I still use the 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 the, the, the three listed brokers. Um, indexes, I use Deriv. I mean, we only find them go Deriv. So, yeah. <laughs> you are my mentor gun card. Do you trade range breakouts index? I tried uh, yesterday. I made some profit, but it was on a demo account. I made a, some profit. Ah, I love a when a brewery account, but I will, I will, I, I, I think I have a lot of on my plate right now. So, but when I have time, maybe in the next two weeks, three weeks, I will try uh, those range breakouts. My one of my friends mentioned those to me. How do I get under your wing? Just inbox me. DM me will take it from there. Hey guys, your questions are a lot. How do I join? Those who want my mentorship or signals, DM me. We'll take it from there. My signals goes for uh fifty dollars. If you join today, you join today. If you join tomorrow, you join tomorrow. If you join uh, uh mid August, you join mid August, but what you need to know is that the subscription ends on the 31st of August. It was actually um, uh, 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 designed to uh, grow people's accounts so that they can afford the $300 uh, mentorship. So, yeah. Mm. No, not that they, when I when I say fundamentals are bad, I don't mean they go opposite direction. I mean like they don't move. You will just waste your time. You will keep holding, hoping that they will go, and you just keep wasting your time. They blow your account. You lose your money. It's just disaster. So, otherwise, guys, um, from your boy CFO, no, I'm no longer CFO. From your boy, the big fish, I am out. Let me focus on my trades, guys. I see some opportunity on crash one thousand, but otherwise, guys, I'm out. Sure.